Good evening, Carlos. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Oh, great. And you? Pretty well. Okay. Um, um, uh, um, 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 the homework, it, it, it's trabajando en homework, homework, uh, and then homework. I'm doing the homework. Uh, yes, I'm doing the homework. Uh, okay. Yesterday, um, to, uh, at night. Okay, so you're doing the homework um, from last uh, night. Estuve trabajando ahora en eso. You, you okay. worked on it today. Yes, teacher. Okay, excellent. So do yes. you have any questions yes. or any doubts yeah. about anything? No, teacher, no question. Okay. And how was your day? Um, good, good, teacher. Um, uh, world um, uh, good and estuve haciendo unos como unos papeles de trabajo de una empresa. Okay. Son papeles de trabajo de auditoría. Oh, interesting. I don't know in English. Yeah, to be honest, I don't know how to say auditoría in English. I have no idea. <laughs> but let me check uh, it. Okay. <laughs> so you have been doing some paperwork. Okay, let's see, auditoria. Oh, paperwork, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, it says audit, auditoria, audit. Audit, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Audit, okay. okay. Yes, a paperwork, audit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, that's interesting. Let's see, oh, yes. 
and you work from home or do you have to go to an office an op um, um, in office in office okay that's nice okay and how about the platform carlos did you finish yes teacher the finished platform uh, yesterday okay excellent congratulations oh thank you and did you get the diploma Oh, no, no revisé ahora, teacher, pero yo creería que ya está, pero se me, no pude revisarlo ahora. Okay, that's fine. You can check it tomorrow or later okay, this night. Okay. Okay. Okay, teacher. Good evening, Janet. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Fine, thank you. And you? Great. How's going? Well, I'm fine. Thanks. Okay, teacher. So, how was your day? Very boring, but all good. And your day? Well, it was nice. Yeah, it was good. Normally. Exactly. <laughs> okay, teacher. It's nice to hear this. I don't know. Yes. <laughs> That's fine. So thank you. <laughs> okay. And how about the platform, Janet? Have you finished? Fíjese que justo antes de de estar aquí en la clase me puse como a las siete y cuarto. Avancé varios videos, pero se cayó la 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 plataforma. Oh. Justo ahorita estaba haciendo eso y se cayó. Okay. Pero sí, ya avancé ya avancé las los videos. Ahorita right. planeo este. Mm. Después de clase, seguir. Ok, pretty good. Ahora que lo voy a hacer ahora. Good evening, mm -hmm. Tamara. Eh, hi. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Eh, it's sleep. <laughs> ok. Nice, but sleep. <laughs> Sleepy. Yeah. Yes. Especially with this weather, right? Yes, it's, a, it's the best moment that I want to sleep. <laughs> yes, I understand it. <laughs> and how about the platform, Tamara? Uh, today I finished finish? the platform. Okay, Yes. very good. And did you get your diploma? Yes, nice. uh, in the moment. Okay, that's pretty cool. Congratulations. Thank you. Good evening, Esmeralda. Hello. Good evening. How's How are you, teacher? I'm doing well, and you? Thank hey. you. Hey. I'm good. Very good. Excellent. Yes. So how about the platform, Esmeralda? <laughs> Did you have any time to work or did you is, finish? Yes, is the section finished? Oh, and yes. see, because today I will do the exam as night. Okay, nice. You're only missing the final test. That's yes. great. Okay. Good evening, Selena. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Oh, very well, teacher. Excellent. So how was your day? Oh, mm, nice. Okay, that's great. And did you get the diploma at the end? Yes, teacher. Okay, nice. Good evening, Gloria. Good evening, teacher. Nice to see you. Nice to see you too. How are you? Fine. Great. And you? Pretty good. Thanks. So how about the platform, Gloria? Have you have you had any time to work? I finish. On it? 
You finished. I finished. Did yes. you get your certificate? No. You didn't. But I finished. Oh, okay. All right. So you can check today or tomorrow. Mm, tomorrow. Okay, nice. Thank you. All right, I think we may start now. <clears throat> so welcome everybody to our class. We're almost done. We only have two classes to go, today's class and tomorrow. That would be it. So let's start by sharing about our perfect vacations. Did you do your homework? Yes? Yes, teacher. Great. Okay, so how about we take turns to share um, what we brought? You just read, okay? So do I have a volunteer to start? Um, all right, teacher. All right, Carlos, go ahead, please. Okay, um, my perfect vacation. I went, to, I went to the United States for a month. I got to Kenov, San Francisco, New York, and Los Angeles. I also went to the Disneyland, to Universal Studios, and I gone to, to Kenov, the NASA Center, had a great time and enjoy it. Enjoy, enjoy it. Enjoy it. Eat to the en fullest. Mm -hmm. Will all my family, wife, and children. I will forget. Okay, very good. Thank you, Carlos. So just, um, yeah, well, we say um, Universal Studios, okay? That's yes. the correct pronunciation, Universal. Universal also, Studios. at the end you said, I will not forget. Is that right? Um, yes. Okay, all right. So pretty good. Thank you for sharing. Oh, thank you. Okay. Next participant. Do I have any volunteers? Uh, me? That is Tamara. Go ahead, please. Yes. It's short. It's okay. It's fine. Okay. Uh, I have a perfect question. I was traveled to Tokyo with my friends. Um, we were... Uh, <laughs> sorry, I don't know what... We were eat uh, noodles um, and stranger see, of course, that both both action figures. Also, I meet new people that learn Japanese. Finally, take the pictures. That's it. Tamara, is that all? Or internal, I don't know who to say. What is it? Sorry, the man I cannot hear you. I don't know if it's. Sí. Tengo pequeños problemas con el internet. No sé qué pasa. Ah, okay. Sí, es que por un momento nos quedamos sí, porque... sin escucharle. Sí, eso vi. Sí, era corto lo que estaba diciendo, pero de ahí yo hasta usted se trabaron un rato y yo me quedé, ok. Oh, ok. So, thank you very much for, for sharing. Um, just a couple of observations. Um, remember about the verbs in the past, right? So, we say, I traveled, I ate, I met, ok. Ok. So, thank you, Tamara. Very good. Next one. How about Esmeralda? Teacher, I'm sorry, but I call, call not see yesterday class because of inter problems. 
Okay, I understand it. Don't worry. I don't know what what the homework is the today. Okay, so don't worry. You just had to write about your perfect vacation as if you already had it. But um, don't worry. We are going to select another classmate to participate now. Then. Okay. Okay. If you Thanks. want to prepare something for tomorrow, we can give you a chance to say it. Okay. All right, so how about Selena? Can you tell us about your perfect vacation? Okay, teacher. My perfect vacation. I have a perfect vacation. I went to Spain with my younger brothers. We visit the city of Barcelona, mainly the st stadium can know. We enjoy the food. I really like it. No, no. Uh, the cultures of the city. I was a spectacular vacation. Great. Thank you, Selena. Um, a couple of things with the pronunciation. We say enjoyed. Enjoyed. And also enjoyed. culture. Culture. Cultured. All right, okay, excellent. Teacher. Thank you. Next one is Gloria. Let's see, Gloria. Did you prepare something about your last vacation or your perfect vacation? Yes, yes, teacher. Um, my perfect vacation where or are on the island, Tasajera Island, because it is a, beauty, a very beautiful island where you can see the most beautiful sunset. When my children live here, we used to visit the island with them. Now I only go with my son and my husband. Okay, excellent, Gloria. Thank you. Nice. So that is here in El Salvador. Yes. Yeah. Um, La Paz. Tasajera. That is in La Paz. Tasajera. Never heard yes. of it. Okay. Interesting. That's nice. Thank you, Gloria. Thank you, teacher. Okay. How about Gerardo? Gerardo, do you have something to present? My perfect vacation. I have a perfect vacation. I went to Mexico. I visited emblematic place, Amon de Playa del Carmen, the Maya Riviera, the Zocalo, and Chichen Itza. I was an amazing trip. All right. Excellent, Gerardo. Very good. And let's see who's missing, Gabriela. Gabriela, do you have something to present? Good night. Hi. My perfect vacation was in Belgium. My best friends company me. We bought some clothes like shoes, shirts, gloves, and purses to enjoy the great music concert calling to Moland dance with scenes and we don't have a lot of fun. Okay, excellent Gabriela. Very nice. I love the idea of that vacation in in Belgium and just to see Tomorrowland and all of that. Sounds pretty cool. Yes. Okay, so congratulations, everybody. You did a great job. Oh, sorry, we're missing Janet. Let's see, Janet. Oh, okay. So don't worry, Janet. Maybe tomorrow you could, I'll you could present your Janet it. To chat. Yes. Thank you, Carlos. So yeah, Janet is having trouble. So she's not able to present today, uh, but yes. maybe tomorrow. 
Okay, so thank you very much for participating in this activity and let's move on. So um, let's remember about the past of be. So yesterday we said that we have two different forms. The first one is was, which we use for I, he, she, and it. And the second one is where, we use it for you, we, and they. So now let's make some examples. Can you help me please? Anybody? I was born in El Salvador. I was born in El Salvador. Very good. It's copy, it's copy, Gerardo. <laughs> <laughs> okay, how about another example? I is mine, yeah. <laughs> she was 29. She was 29. Great. Another one. Esmeralda, can you make one, please? He was, he was born in Colombia. Okay, he was born in Colombia. Thank it's you. It's necessary that is born, only born? No. You can add a different I think uh, component. Oh, okay. 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 So how about another example from Gloria? You wear nice car. You wear nice car. Nice car? Is that what you said? Yes. Um, well, in that case, you need to change it to have, right? Or had. You had a nice oh, car. Yes. Okay. And but we can keep it yes, as yes. you were nice. Like you were nice. Tu fuiste muy eh, bueno, right? You were nice. Okay. All right. And chat. Thanks, and Gloria. chat, Jan is messenger. Messen. Oh. Okay, let's see. All right, Janet, in that example, case, we need example. to say singing. Yeah. So he was singing, we say in that case, Janet. He was singing. Sings, he was singing. Singing. Okay. okay, pretty well. So that's how we use the verbs was and where. So let's see, now we are going to practice with some more exercises. Let me read some sentences and you tell me if we complete them using was or were. So the first one is, I bored. Do I say was or were? Was. was. I was bored. I right? was, I was. Very good, I was bored. Next one. He on holiday was or where? Was. 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 He was on holiday. Next one says, we at home. We were, were. at home. Were. We, were, we at were at home. Exactly. Then we have you happy. Were. were. You were happy. You were happy. Exactly. You were happy. And the last one, she at the disco. Was. She was, she was on the disco. She was, she was on the disco. at the disco. Okay, the disco. great. So now let me tell you some sentences in the present. I need you to change them to the past. So let's start with Gerardo. I am seven years old. I was seven years old. Very good. Esmeralda, you are my best friend. Repeat, please. You I'm are. Listening. Okay, it's you are my best friend. You were my best friend. Okay, nice. Next one, Gloria, your bike is in the garage. You, you were. 
let me repeat it. Car. Your bike, your bike is in the garage. Your bike where in the bulk. Okay, do we say where or was in that case? Your bike, it. Where? For it, we use was, was. right? Your bike. So let me just write it here so it's clear. Your bike was in the garage. Like this, okay? So we're talking about okay. the bike. So it's it. Because it, it, was... it okay. Mm -hmm. Pretty well, thank you, Gloria. And the next sentence is for Carlos. The boys are very kind. The, repeat, teacher. The boys are very kind. The boys? Boys. Boys, uh-huh. Boys or boy? It's boys, like kids. Boys. Ah, uh, the boys. Mm -hmm. Um. The boys were. Exactly, the boys were very were, kind. Very, uh, uh, sorry, no, I don't know lo último. Oh, okay. Let me write it for you. Like oh, this, very kind. Very okay. Kind, okay, kind teacher. sería amable. <laughs> okay. Thanks, teacher. All right, thanks to you. Next one, Tamara. The bottle is on the table. What? The bottle? The bottle is on it's the table. Botella. Exactly. Ah, okay. Uh, the bottle were on the table. Where or was? Oh. Was, I'm sorry, the bottle was, was, was on the table. Exactly, very good. So we say the bottle was, because the bottle is it, right? It was. It's it. <laughs> okay, so thank you. All right, let's continue. By talking about where we were yesterday at a specific time. So let's see. Um, we are going to ask this question to the people in the session. For example, let me ask Gerardo. Gerardo, where were you yesterday at nine in the morning? In my work. Okay, so you say I was in my work or I was at work. Okay, I was at work. Excellent. Now it's your turn to ask somebody here. You can choose any of your classmates. And you ask them, where were you yesterday at? And you mention a specific time. Gerardo, go ahead. Tamara, where were you yesterday? yesterday? Uh, evening. Uh, I was. I don't know if if I can. Uh, cook or sea, poner cocinar o algo por el estilo. Um. Well, in this case, we're talking about the place where where. So you oh, need to I'm mention sorry. a place. Okay. It was in my house. <laughs> All right, nice. Now ask okay. somebody, please, Tamara. Okay. Uh, Esmeralda. Uh, where were where were you yesterday at night? I was in my house. Very good, Esmeralda. Can you ask somebody else, please? Um, Carlos. Okay. Carlos, where were you yesterday at last weekend? Um, you have to mention some specific uh, time of uh, yesterday, okay. okay? We're talking about yesterday. Okay. Okay, repeat. Where were you yesterday at 
in the afternoon? I I I was um, driving my car um, the homework of oh, the the trabajo manejar mi carro desde el trabajo no sé algo así. I was driving home or I was coming yes. from my work. Yes, teacher. I was home home. I was driving right home. Home. Yes, driving home. Okay, great. Carlos, ask somebody. Oh, um, Janet. Okay. Oh, Janet is there, yeah. Yeah, Janet can only answer in this. No problem. No problem on the microphone. Eh? Mm, yes. Okay, entonces, Gabriela. Hi. Hi. Where were you yesterday at, at um, in the morning? At morning, perdón, at morning. In the morning, sorry. That would be in the morning, you're right. In the morning, uh, where, yes. where, where were you yesterday in the morning? It was my home. Okay. You were home too, Gabriela, okay, nice. So let me just tell you over here, I added at because I want you to mention a specific time. So it could be at eight in the morning, at 2 p.m. Or it could be at 4 p.m. or in the afternoon. Okay, so try to mention a specific time. All right, Gabriela, okay. can you ask Selena, please? Elena, where were yesterday? 12 p.m. Oh. I was eat my long my lunch. Okay, you were eating your lunch. Great. Oh. Okay, so Selena, you can ask Gloria, please. Oh, Gloria, where were you yesterday at three afternoon? I was in the store. All right, nice, you were in a store. Great, Gloria, thank you. Now make a question to Janet. And Janet, we wait for your answer in the chat. Okay, Janet, where were you yesterday at 7 p.m.? So let's see, Janet. Janet was in her house, she says. Okay, great. So let me just point out some things. Remember that last time I mentioned that in order to say the times of the day or the parts of the day, we say in the morning. Mm -hmm. For example, if you wanted to ask, where were you yesterday in the morning? Where were you yesterday in the morning? Or I was say, breakfast. Exactly, you can answer that. Then we have in the afternoon or in the evening. But the noon? we say at, solo at noon, only at night, yeah? night or noon. At noon and at night. Okay. okay. Yes, and that's how we do it. And then if we want to mention a specific time, we use at to at six o'clock. Okay. So for okay. specific time, night and noon, we use at for the others in the, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening. Okay, pretty well. So now let's make some excuses. I know we are very responsible people, so we don't use them, but let's try it. So let's suppose that you're late to the class. What's your excuse? For example, you could say, well, I was stuck in traffic. That's a good one, right? <laughs> so you say, I was stuck in traffic. That's what many students would say. So what's another what do you excuse? Say stuck? Atrapado? Spanish? Okay. Estaba atrapado. Estoy atrapado en el tráfico. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. 
Okay, so any other excuse that you give when you are late to some place? Think about it, please. I was oversleep. I overslept. Nice. I overslept. Mm -hmm. Any other? Oh, y para poner teacher, me dejó el bus. I missed the bus. I missed, I missed. the bus. Oh. Mm -hmm. It was cooking. Can you repeat it, please? Okay, another one could be my car broke down. Se me arruinó el carro, right? My car broke down. Okay, so how about this one? You didn't come to the party. Oh, let me just erase this. So you didn't come to the party. Why? What's the excuse? Hello, Samuel. Yes, I was. I was feel sick. I was very sick. Okay. I was. I was no money. <laughs> I had no money. I had the money. Okay. What else? Gerardo, do you have one? I was... Oh, para decir... Mm -hmm. Excuse me. No tenía no. para regalo. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't have a very present good. or I didn't have a money for the present. I can't dance. Mm -hmm. I can't dance. Mm -hmm. Okay. I can dance. Yeah. Any other? I, have... I was I was busy. I was busy, of course. I okay. Take care of my children. Busy. I took care of my children. Okay. Very busy. Right. Um, busy, ocupada. Okay. All right. The next one says you didn't bring the homework. So what happened? Oh, I was understand. I didn't understand. Okay. I didn't always. Okay. What else? I didn't work. I didn't work on it or I didn't do it, right? Okay. Okay. Porque else? no tuve tiempo. So how do you say that in English? I didn't have time. I didn't have time, exactly. I didn't have time to do it, maybe. To do it. Mm -hmm. Any other excuse? Teacher, yeah? I have a question. Y to do it, es cuando agrega to do it, es como para decir el qué. Para, para entender hacerla. el qué. No tuve ah, tiempo hacerla. de hacerla. Si digo, okay. I didn't have time, no tuve tiempo. Si digo, mm -hmm. I didn't have time to do it, no tuve tiempo de hacerla. O no okay. tuve tiempo para hacerla, ¿ok? Ok, teacher, thanks. All right. Any other? I forgot I in my house. I forgot it in my house. Yes, I hear that a lot. <laughs> Any other? Okay, here I have oh. another situation that would be, you forgot your wedding anniversary. So what do you tell your wife or your husband? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, that's a good one, Gabriela. I didn't want to do the homework. Okay. <laughs> I was a picnic. I was... I had a picnic. I had a picnic. 
Okay. Like, uh, what do you mean with that, Carlos? What? Teacher. Um, yes. Excuse me. What the meaning you forgot your winning anniversary? You olvidé tu aniversario. Usted olvidó su aniversario de bodas. Oh, okay. okay. No, sorry, teacher. No, no, no. no. Okay, no worry. <laughs> so, y entonces no, hay, es la forgot. razón por la que lo olvidé. Yeah, you have to make an excuse. Ah, okay. ¿Qué excusa um, pondría? I, I had, I had very work. Mucho trabajo. I had a lot of work. A lot of, a lot of work. Great. What else? I had many tasks. I had many tasks. Okay. Any other thing? Oh. What do you mean tax? What is it? What the meaning tax teach? Oh, tasks that would be tareas. Oh, okay. Tenía muchas tareas. Yeah. Thanks. I am very careless. I am very careless. Okay. I forgot it completely. I completely forgot it. Very good. Okay. And I believe we have our last situation that is <clears throat> you didn't give a birthday present to your best friend. What's the excuse? No money. I have no money. <laughs> I had no money. Okay. <laughs> I had no money. <laughs> Any other thing? Oh, no sabía que regalar. I no remember. I didn't no know recorded. what to no, give him or her. I no remember your birthday. I didn't remember your birthday. Qué mala amiga. <laughs> Any other? Uh, I for was me to celebrate the other day. Okay. Okay, pretty well. So we're good at making excuses, right? So now let's talk a little bit about the past of be in the negative form. So for that, we have again, two different forms. The first one is was, but we use it together with the not. So it becomes was not. And we use it for I, he, she, and it. I was not, he was not, she was not, and it was not. And then we have the contracted form, which is wasn't. wasn't, right? Was not or wasn't. Repeat, please. I was not. I was not. I was, I not. was not. He was not. He was he not. Was he not. was not. She was not. She was, he was, was not. It was not. It was it not. Was was not. not. Okay, and then you can change the was not for the contracted form, wasn't. wasn't. Then wasn't. the second wasn't. form we have is were not. We use were not were. for you, we, and they. And the contracted form for were not would be? Weren't. Weren't, exactly. Mm. So you say you were not, we were not, they were not, or they were you not. weren't, we weren't, they weren't. Repeat, please. You were not. You were not. You were not. You were not. We were not. We were, we not. were not. not. They were not. They were they not. Were they were not. not. Okay, so the structure that we use in order to make sentences is this one. 
First of all, we need a subject. Then we add was not or were not. And at the end, we need a complement. And remember, we can also use the contracted forms wasn't or weren't. Here I have some examples. I was not at home. I was not at home. I was at work. Read the next example, please, Gabriela Mejia. She wasn't angry. She was just bored. Thanks. Next one, Tamara. Eh, uh, yeah, oh, <laughs> we're not oh, contract contracting. Um, uh, just read this one. They were not okay, they were not uh, in a party, mm -hmm. they were at uh, the parent house. Excellent, thanks. Okay, so as you see, we only use subject, then the was not or wasn't, were not, or we have another example with weren't, you weren't at the mall, and then the complement. So it's pretty easy. Just remember, was not, were not, or wasn't, and weren't. So here I have some practice for you. Now we are going to make some sentences in the negative and affirmative form. So how come? Here we have different words or phrases. Then we are going to make an affirmative sentence using the first phrase or word in a negative sentence with the second one. For example, the first, it goes like, it was very cold, it wasn't hot. It was very cold, it wasn't hot. And then you continue like, he was so happy, he wasn't sad and so on. So let me just send you a couple of minutes to the breakout rooms so you work in small groups and you do this, okay? I'm going to send the picture to the chat so you have the words and you are going to work in small groups. Yes? Yes. Okay. So let me change, let's see. Okay, there you are. Please accept the invitation. Ah, so, so the uh, it was very cold. Uh -huh. It in, wasn't uh, hot. It wasn't hot. Okay. He he was so happy. Sí. She was she wasn't sad. Did. Hola. Hello. Hola. Hola. Me escuchan. Um, hi, Esmeralda. Are you having trouble? Hi, teacher. And yes. So, Creo que no me escuchan ellas o no las escucho yo a ellas. Okay, so maybe we're having trouble. Let's see, Tamara, Claudia, are you there? Maybe not. Okay, so let's practice together, Esmeralda. Let's see, um, did you get a picture? Está saliendo ahí. 
Yes. Okay. So remember, we are going to make some affirmative and negative sentences. For example, the first one, it was very yes. cold. It wasn't hot. Next one is? Okay. He was so happy. He mm -hmm. wasn't sad. Exactly. The dog, the dog was fast. The dog wasn't slow. Nice. Sister in law was Canada. Sister in law wasn't Italy. Okay, in that case, we need to add in. My sister in law was in Canada and she wasn't in Italy. Okay, she wasn't. Ah, yes. okay. Okay, ah, es que no, no, no logré ver bien la imagen, permita. Okay. Entonces sería. Ah, yeah. yeah. My sister in law or she she sister no girl. No, my sister, my sister in, -law in law was in Canada. In, in Canada. In Canada. Uh, mm -hmm. My sister in law in my sister in law was in Canada. My sister in law was in Italy in Italy. Exactly. It goes like that. Okay. Caroline was a student. student? Yeah. Caroline wasn't teacher. All right. Just you say um Caroline was a student. I student. She wasn't I student. a teacher, okay? She a wasn't teacher. a teacher. Porque es la profesión, ¿verdad? Yes. Exactly. Okay. The weather was rain, rainy. Rainy. Rainy, the weather wasn't sun. Exactly, the weather. The weather, the weather, the weather. We, we were is classmates. Yes. We weren't is friends. We weren't friends. We weren't friends. My silver was excited yes. what's the meaning siblings siblings is your brothers and sisters Besides, no my brother? brothers and sisters hermanos pero ah, mi cuando, hermanos. Decimos, cuando decimos brothers son solo hermanos mm -hmm. hombres cuando decimos siblings mm -hmm. puede incluir hermanos y hermanas ah ok pero eso aplica solo a hermanos eh, sanguíneos. Um, I mean, it doesn't matter. En realidad no, ah, okay. no hay distinción con eso, solamente que en este incluimos amba, ambos sexos, ¿verdad? Ambos Entonces, sexos. Masculino ah, y femenino, okay. hermanos y hermanas. Porque cuando decimos solo ah, brothers, okay. son hermanos. Cuando decimos sisters, Herman son hermanas. Entonces, para hermanas. decir los dos okay. juntos, siblings. Sí. My siblings were excited. Yes. My siblings weren't depressed. Weren't depressed. 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 What okay. the meaning depressed? Deprimidos. Ah, okay. Entonces ahí sí se ocuparía el a antes o no? Um, a no, depressed. In case you don't no. use it. No, they were depressed. That's what depressed. we Depressed. Okay? Ah, okay. Okay. All right. Thank so it's time to get back. Thank you, teacher. All right. Okay, so we're back. Do you have any questions about any of the sentences or about any of the words you see here? No question, teacher. No questions? Okay, pretty good. Do you know the meaning of siblings? Hermanos. Herman Hermanas y hermanos. Exactly. So it includes both brothers and sisters. Because when you use the word brothers, you are only talking about men, okay? And then when you use sisters, it's only women. 
So if you want to say hermanos, including both brothers and sisters, you use siblings. 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 Okay. Siblings. So let's continue. So today lesson's objective is by the end of this class, you will learn how to ask and answer questions with the verb, the pass of the verb be. So let's study the questions. So first of all, let's check this sentence. It says, Melissa was very nervous. So what do I do in order to make it a question? Well, again, you have to change the order of the elements. How come? Well, that was has to go first. And Melissa, which is the subject, goes to the second place. And it becomes, was Melissa very nervous? Was Melissa very nervous? So you just change those elements. The verb comes first, was or were. Then the subject, in this case, Melissa. And then the complement and question mark. And that will be it. So this is a structure to follow. Was, where, then the subject, then the complement, the question mark. Here I have another example. Was it a good trip? Yes, it was, or no, it wasn't. Can you help me to read the second example, Carlos, please? Um, were you at your mom's house yesterday? Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Exactly. Next example, Esmeralda. Okay. Uh, were Jack and Anne at the theater? Yes, they were. No, they weren't. All right, pretty good. So as you see, all the questions start with was or where, and then the subject, okay? So just remember that we start with was or where, depending on the subject. Now let's practice. Can you make a question out of the sentence? You are ready for the trip. Make a question, please. Were you ready for, were the, you trip? Ready for, were the, trip? You ready for the trip? Were you ready for the trip? Exactly. Were you ready for the trip? Excuse Next me, what one? is the meaning of trip? Oh, trip was Sarah is... there? Was Sarah 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 there? Okay, somebody was asking about the meaning of trip. That is viaje, okay? Viaje. Viaje. Mm -hmm. viaje. Mm -hmm. Okay, number three, the tourists were from Panama. Were the tourists, were the tourists from, from Panama? Panama. 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 Were the tourists from Panama? Number four, my dad was so angry at me. Was my dad, was so, my dad, my dad, dad so angry, so at, angry me? at me? Excellent. It was what a nice dream. A nice dream. What's it what a night dream? A night a dream. Nice dream. Very good. You were on the were yellow you, bus. Were, were you, were you on, on the bus? yellow bus? You were busy last, last night. You bus last night. You bus last night. Were you busy last night? Ah, uh, busy. Were you busy hmm. last? Were you busy last night? Exactly, very good. Next one says, Anthony and you were invited to the party. Were you, were, um, were Anthony and, and you, you invite invited to the, to the party? Great. The answer was incorrect. Was the answer the incorrect? The answer incorrect. incorrect. Yes. And Sophie was very embarrassed. Was so what, 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 very embarrassed. 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 Okay. <laughs> so it's embarrassed, right? What's the meaning of embarrassed? Okay. Avergonzar. Avergonzado. Yes. Exactly. All right. So that will be it for today's class. Thank you for participating and your attention too. And uh, well, tomorrow we have the last class. <laughs> So um, please keep on working in the platform and also check if you have the diplomas. 
Um, there's a little okay. bill too. Um, check that you have your diploma in only one page. El diploma debería estar en una sola página y debe ir firmado. O sea, todo debe ser en una sola hoja. Revisemos por favor okay. porque eh, se me han reportado por ahí alguno que sale en dos hojas. Entonces eso hay que arreglarlo por si acaso tuviéramos ese inconveniente con alguno. So please check. Ok, okay. teacher. Ok, sería okay. que cualquier cosa me dice. Ok. Ok. Ok, good night. Okay. Good night. Take care. Good night, teacher. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. See you tomorrow. Ok.